Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Where do I even begin? And we can arrive the book and share that feel of love. I wanna ride So this video will be a hair vlog of me getting my hair done and getting revamped because I look crazy right now. As you can see, my hair has grown out a lot since I've had the sewing in. It's been about two months at this point. If not two months, it's close. So um, it's time to get this hair done and to take this sewing out it did its job thanks to my girl that did it she did amazing because even so there's still no tracks like lifting or anything like that or loose so my girl did good but it's time for it to go so we're gonna get it done tomorrow at the salon i'm going to the dominicans and i'm just getting a wash a set a blowout or whatever and color because these grays are showing in the front gotta go so yeah so i'm gonna get it washed um wash color set blow dry whatever and i'm also thinking about cutting it into a bob yeah so i'm thinking more like right by the chin or below the chin a little bit i've had a bob before but it was years ago like years ago and it was like hair like by my chin and it was because I had a lot of damage so for it to look good and even and full she had to cut it that short but but now I don't think it would need to be that short I hope not but the plan is to get it done here um so we'll see but definitely I do want to cut it or trim it or do something it's gonna get cut tomorrow how, the length of it i don't know as yet currently or at least not currently but the last time i got my hair done like my natural hair done and it was like straight my hair was by my shoulder so it you know it's it's a good length but my hair is also um i don't how do i explain it like the roots is thick but once it gets to like the shaft of the hair it gets thin almost right so i that's why i want to cut it because i don't like when the ends look thin and you can see through the hair like i don't like that so that's another reason why i want to cut it and just even it out because it'll it'll just look better so like i said i'm about to have my sister take <clears throat> excuse me i'm about to have my sister take out my hair now like take out the tracks now um i'm gonna have her help me out because i don't trust myself <laughs> cutting out tracks because i would hate to cut my hair and that has happened before and we're not going to repeat that again so i'm gonna have my little sister help me out cutting out the tracks i'm gonna take out the braids comb it out and detangle it and then um get it done tomorrow so you guys are gonna follow me tomorrow to get it done all right y'all so i see you later okay guys so i took out all the tracks as you can see and look at my new growth crazy oh my god but i'm about to take these braids out detangle it and then detangle it and then put it up in a little ponytail <sighs> until tomorrow i am so tired like i'm exhausted but i just wanted to show y'all that i took it out and the new growth is just crazy 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 but and my little sister she cut <laughs> She cut my hair. But it's cool. It's only that little piece, so I'm fine. All right, y'all. I'm about to take these braids out, detangle it, and then 
call it a night because I am tired. I can barely keep my eyes open. So, and these braids is mad small. Like, <sighs> it's fine. It's fine. All right. So, I see y'all. So, I found the piece of hair that she <laughs> cut. <laughs> oh, Lord. Uh, it's okay. Like I said, I'm not attached to my hair like that anymore, so it's fine. But this is what was cut off. It was still braided in, so this is what was cut off. But to be honest, the way the girl sewed in the tracks, it was very... And I also had a net on, so it was very difficult to see, like, to differentiate between my hair, the net that she sewed on, and the thread for the tracks so i guess she just you know thought she got a thread and it wasn't it was my hair so yeah but it's cool look at that it's mad long <laughs> hang time <laughs> hey guys <laughs> all right so if you can't tell by the sound of my voice and how ashy my face is, it's morning time. And um, it's Friday morning, so that means I took a day off of work because, <sighs> y'all, I'm exhausted. I'm not even going to hold y'all. I am exhausted. I'm tired. All week, I've been oversleeping. Every single day, I've been oversleeping. So... I've been getting to work late, not like terribly late because luckily I don't live far from my job, like 10 minutes. So I still make it within the 10 minute <laughs> grace period, but I just, I've been, I've just been out of it. I have been out of it ever since this entire, actually ever since <clears throat> excuse me ever since the new year started i just haven't been here like i started off the year good like the first two months but as soon as february hit i just felt like everything just went my energy's not there and i'm taking my vitamins y'all so don't even bother i'm taking vitamins b complex b12 the whole nine i drink coffee and nothing has really been helping. So, I don't know. So, I just, I originally took this day off to get my hair done, which I am. But the original hairstyle that I had planned for today was to get box braids. But we're not going to do that today. We're going to do that at a later date. I don't have the mental capacity to just sit in a chair for eight hours. I don't have it. And I just, so we're going to, um get a wash and blow like i mentioned previously um i don't want to give my hair a break too i don't want to like take it out of braids and then braid it back up again so i kind of want to give it like a, a break to breathe and stuff so that's why we're just gonna get my natural hair done and like i said i'm considering cutting my hair into a bob so we'll see how that goes but i'm very excited to go and get my hair done today because it is well needed. I haven't washed, washed, like got deep into my scalp in like two months. So I'm very excited to get it done today. So yeah, but is it just me y'all or like, has this year already been draining? Like, tell me, and it's going so fast. It's going by so quickly. Like, I can't believe we're already in March of the new year i felt like it just started but it also feels very draining i don't know also if you guys can tell i am in i'm in a sports bra so i'm not naked or naked <laughs> i'm not naked i'm in a sports bra and if you can't tell it's Look at my face. I feel like my eyes, like the bags under my eyes is just 
very apparent. I don't like that. Uh, hopefully this weekend I'm able to catch up on some much needed rest. Because I need it. I've just been... Or not, actually, it hasn't... It hasn't been like I've been doing a lot of stuff. Like the normal, like go to work and stuff. Yeah. And then, you know, YouTube now and content creation is now my hobby that I do when I get out of work. So I guess, you know, those are the two things that has really been consuming my mind. But it's nothing to the point where I should be feeling this tired. I don't know, but it's whatever it's it's the weekend or it's about to be the weekend it's friday so i'm just praying that i get catch up on some rest this weekend so that next week i can start anew and feel rejuvenated because i really need i need that i need i need that. but anyways um as you can tell i am dressed to go to the gym. So even though we called off of work today, we're still gonna make it a productive day. So for the past two days, I started on, what's today? Today's Friday, then I started on Wednesday, going to the gym. And the goal is to go at least five to six times a week with one rest day or two rest days um, until summer. Well, actually not until summer is because there's no deadline to it i'm trying to make this a lifestyle so yeah, make it to the gym i'm at home doing something or i'm going for a walk especially since the weather's starting to get nicer um now um it's one of the two things that i'm doing or three things like um i have to be active and i also feel like that helps with how i've been feeling because i've been feeling very restless and lazy so I feel like if I'm, you know, more active, like physically active, then that will help with my mood and me feeling that way. So all of this goes hand in hand. Um, so yeah, so that's what I'm trying to do now. I'm also trying to eat better. See, let me tell you something about this weight loss, right? Or just me in general. I can work out. I can go to the gym, I can do all the exercises, I can work out. But you see that nutrition, that eating portion, that is where I struggle the most. And I know it's not just me. I feel like everyone has that struggle where it's the eating that's the hardest part of this entire thing. But it's like, and I'm tired of doing diets. I feel like, diets don't work for me so i think now what i'm going to do is just eat everything in moderation and when i say moderation i mean smaller portions and not so frequent <laughs> and start replacing some things with other healthier things so for instance for dinner like my for dinner or like my 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 main or my favorite carb is rice it has always been, I don't know if it's a Caribbean thing, but that is my favorite carb, is rice. And you know rice is bad for you. Everyone knows this, cool. But now I'm thinking of, instead of taking away rice <laughs> from me, I'm just going to lessen how much rice I eat. So cut it in not even half because well i don't even eat a lot of rice anymore like that maybe like a cup and a half is what i eat now but maybe like cut that in half and then majority of my plate will be vegetables and protein of some sort <sighs> yeah because cutting things out of my diet is that is what makes me not be able to stick to a diet like i can't just cut it out that's just I don't know I just can't do that so yeah I think me just cutting like eating it in moderation and just cutting my portions will better help me so we're gonna try that out along with going to the gym for five to six days out of the week um yeah and if we can't make it to the gym we are doing something at home 
or we're going for a walk but <clears throat> excuse me but we're gonna stay active like that's the goal that's the goal um i'm trying not to i have a scale but i'm trying not to i guess depend like i'm not trying to be consumed with the scale like consume with the idea of my weight on a scale so i will be weighing myself but it won't be frequent it'll just be like i don't even know once a week or once a month i don't know but i'm gonna figure that part out because we do need to know where we're starting at, but I'm just mainly just focused on me just feeling healthier and getting out of this funk that I'm in. And yeah, and obviously some weight loss as well. So we're gonna have to weigh ourselves, but I'm gonna mostly go by if I can see a difference in like the way my clothes fit in the mirror, like how I look in the mirror. So we'll see, we'll see, we'll see, but yeah. We're about to start doing that now. No. I'm off to a late start. I did want to get up earlier and head to the gym because my hair appointment is at 2 o'clock and it's already 10.51. So, am I missing something? No. Yeah, like I was saying. So, it is. I'm off to a late start. It's already 10.52. I kind of wanted to already be at the gym by 9 30 10 o'clock but it's cool i needed that extra sleep <laughs> so it's fine i'm not gonna beat myself up about it it is friday so i don't think a lot of people will be at the gym so it shouldn't be that crowded <sighs> so yeah i should be fine i should be fine it shouldn't be that crazy all right and so we're all moisturized and sunscreened it up. And so now we about to head to the gym. But first, I'm going to make myself some coffee. And um, then we're going to head out. Because I need something in my system. Because when I work out and I don't eat, I literally feel like I want to pass out. So I'm going to drink some coffee. And yeah. So, like I said, today's video will be like, a, it's mostly a hair vlog because that's really what this vlog is about. But I'm also going to incorporate what I did the day I got my hair done as well. So, yesterday I saw that I took the weave out. Today we're going to the gym and we're getting our hair done and that's pretty much it. So, let's go. Vacation time. Yeah. You and your girlfriend, too bad, mine. My back bad when you both combine. I don't know why you look so nice. Right now, we're just taking time. Yeah. All the things are on your mind. And you want my back bad when I treat you right. I don't care how you look so nice. I need to hold a corner and the slow wine. One time, I need to hold a corner and the slow wine. One time, yeah. you got some vacation time. Yeah. You and your girlfriend too bad, mine. My bad, bad when you both combine. I don't know how you look so nice Right now we're just taking time All the things are on your mind They you want my bad bad when I treat you right I don't care how you look so nice You've got some vacation time Want me to feel like I'm no You and your girlfriend too bad mine Don't care you look so nice Being bad 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 when you both combine Look what you're putting me through I don't know why you look so nice I need to find out where you're taking time All the things are on your mind I need to bad 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 when I treat you right Watch it. 
time, yeah. I need to hold a corner. And it's no one. I'm tired. I need to hold a Oh my god y'all it is so nice outside my car is so hot like i have to take the jacket off because i will begin sweating before i even get to the gym all right anyways so now we finally left the house we are now we're about to head um to the gym so let's go i'm thinking about going to the one well, I'm trying to decide which gym I want to go to. Decisions, decisions. Uh, I think I'm gonna go to the one by my job because, which is where I called out of work. I didn't call out, I requested off weeks ago because I was gonna get my hair done and I am gonna get my hair done, but it's not the hairstyle that I originally took it off for, taken off for. So, but I'm gonna go to the one by my job. It's not in the same complex, but it's in the complex, like two, two complexes down. Cause anyway, so yeah, we're gonna go to that gym because I'm just familiar with that gym. It's nice. And I also have a very strong feeling that it won't be packed. So I think I'm gonna go there. And mostly today, for the past two days, I've been doing full body workouts. Um, and I have and I have been just um, researching my own workouts because at the moment, I cannot afford to get a trainer. So, and yeah, I, I can't afford to get a trainer. That's the honest and God truth. But I won't let this be an excuse because I can't afford a trainer that doesn't mean I just can't go to the gym at all so I have been you know on YouTube YouTube University and just looking up some workouts like you know beginner friendly um why does she look like she's not stopping beginner friendly and yeah for now at least until whether I could get a trainer or just see if I could do this my damn self, period. Like, we not even gonna waste no time. And it seems like everyone is out for a walk. I've never been home at this, on a Friday at this time outside before. I'm always at work. So to see people are outside walking and being active, it's just motivating me even more to get my behind up and work out period no excuses none whatsoever cool. i'm just gonna be in the gym for like an hour so i'm gonna do like a 30 minute workout and i'm this time i'm gonna focus on my arms and my back and the you the video that i found that was a workout was 20 minutes yeah 20 minutes so i'm gonna do that and then I'm going to um, go on the treadmill for another 30 minutes and then get out. Like, I'm not even going to do nothing else as an extra. And then, um, yeah, head back home, shower, get ready. Um, and then, yeah, head to the hair salon to get my hair done. So, yeah, guys. I really like this vlogging thing, to be honest. It's kind of weird because you're like talking to yourself, but you're not talking to yourself because you know eventually when you post this video or you post this, 
someone will be watching it as well and so technically you're talking to them but in the meantime as you're actually recording you're talking to yourself so that's very weird it gives personality disorder issues <laughs> What I also love about vlogs is that the editing process is not as tedious as if I was doing like a tutorial or like a haul or something where there's a lot of like cutting out a vlog. I could talk regular because at the end of the day, this is what it is. It's a vlog. It's the day in my life. It's like this is what it is. So there's not much really to edit out besides like unnecessary clips that I probably don't feel like it's just necessary to put in there actually making it is like effortless there's nothing to really do as y'all can see i didn't do my hair i didn't do my makeup i didn't do none of that i just came on here regular and i did notice that someone so sweet had commented on my last vlog saying that uh they appreciated that i came or i appeared in the vlog regular no makeup you know like no like not dolled up just regular and this is really what i look like 99% of the time that 1% is when I go out so yeah this is this is real so I did appreciate that sweet comment thank you so much and I definitely commented back saying thank you um so yeah so this is why vlogs to me are just easier content to create because it doesn't require much thinking process you're literally just picking up the camera and recording what you're doing the hardest part is remembering to pick up the camera to record what you're doing because sometimes you're just so in the zone that you forget but yeah Okay guys, we have finally left the house. I am uber late. It is 3.02, so I'm super late. I said I was trying to get there for two o'clock, but as y'all can see, I had a late start to my day anyway, so it took a lot out of me <laughs> today, um, so yeah. So now we're about to head to the nail salon. I mean, not nail salon. I need to get my nails done. But we're about to head to the... To the... Mm, nail so Hair salon. But I'm... Just go. So yeah, so I'm about to head to the hair salon now. Um, I'm about 17 minutes away, so I should get there at 3.20, um, which is a good time still. Hopefully it's not super packed, fingers crossed. So yeah, we're about to head there and then we'll see. And I'm getting the full treatment today, okay? We're getting a deep treatment. We're getting a cut. I'm still deciding if I want to do a bob, like cut my hair into a bob. We're still deciding that, but we'll see. I'll see how I feel when I get there. Um, what else? We're going to color my hair jet black because that's what I do. Um, and yeah and that's it and then that'll be it for my hair vlog <laughs> so yeah so i will keep y'all posted when i get there um right now i need my gps because i haven't gone to her in a minute so i kind of the stop sign then at the next one you turn right I don't remember exactly where I'm going, so yeah. But uh, yeah, so I'll check you out when I get to the nails, 
I keep saying nail salon. Ugh. <sighs> Cause every, you know why I'm keep saying nail salon? Because this direction that I'm going is normally the, the direction I would go. Right onto Seneca Road. It's normally the, the direction I would go to get my nails done. But yeah, we're going to the hair salon. So I will see y'all when I get to the hair salon. Okay guys, so now I'm back home um, and my hair looks so good and it looks so healthy. Ah, I love it. So as you can see, I didn't cut it into a bob, but I did cut it. So I cut it about like two inches off. Um, so it was, it was a little longer than this. Let me just turn around so you can see the back. It looks so good. Right? So yeah. So um I was going to record her like blow drying my hair, um, flat ironing it, cutting it, and all that stuff, but my phone died. So I got none of that footage and I forgot to bring my um portable battery or my portable charger with me. So it died but um it's cool it's fun but she did such an amazing job i love going to her because she does not fry my hair like most dominicans do and she also like gives my hair a lot of body like i don't leave her salon with like flat hair if that makes sense like i feel like when you go to the dominicans your hair look it looks straight but it looks so flat it has no body it's just it has no body yeah <laughs> so with her she does it where you know it gives it some body she doesn't press it to crisp like i still have hair <laughs> at the end of it and i love it i love it i did make her do curls this time normally i would just make her do the normal straight and bump the ends but this time i made her do some curls only because when i wrap it tonight i want when i take it out tomorrow or whenever i take it out of the wrap that it has body and it still has that look to it you know but yeah so she did an amazing job i love it and yeah so this is gonna be my new hairdo until it's time to go get braids which i'll probably do it in april what are we in now march so yeah i'll probably do it in like april and yeah but i love it and my hair grew a lot guys like this is amazing this is amazing and my roots is still very much black because i did make her um rinse it black like jet black because i like my hair jet black you know my gray hairs be disrespecting me out here <laughs> so i did make her um color it jet black 
but i don't know what kind of jet black they got because this is not a permanent color this is rinse i don't know what kind of color they got over there but as you can see like my hairline is still very much a little black not too much not like not too crazy she tried to take most of it out but still but my scalp is damn near <laughs> it's damn near black oh well kind of but right here you could barely tell i have a part here because it's so dark but whatever it's cool but i love it guys Isn't it so cute? <laughs> All right, so this is the end of today's vlog. So I'm going to wrap my hair up and then we're going to call it a night and take that behind to bed. So I catch y'all in the next video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. We need them subscriptions. We need them. We need them subscriptions going up and up and up. So far, guys. Oh my God. Let me tell you a milestone that we've reached. So far, we have a thousand views. <laughs> so in the last twenty-eight days, we've had a thousand views, and that's all. T all thanks to you guys. Thank you so much, um, and thank you so much for all your love and support in the comments um but we do need to step up them <laughs> them likes and the subscriptions just so you know we keep we keep it tight okay so if you guys like anything that i post in any of my videos click that subscribe button click that like button and if you like to comment you can comment if you like to just say hey say hey and i'll comment back i comment literally back to every single person that comments on my post I mean, on my videos, so, you know, just do all the things, all the things, <laughs> but I'm going to call it a night, I am so tired, like, I don't know if y'all can tell in my eyes, but I'm exhausted, so yes, thank you again, and I'll see you guys in the next video.